He looks intimidating up there. I'm even gonna ask. Oh, he totally has amazing reach. Oh my gosh, GG zombies. Hey guys, welcome to IGT. Today we are playing Colony Survival with the Beebs. Hey, Beebs. Hey. Hi. All right, Beebs, show me your base. Look. Whoa, this is look beautiful. Inside. This is your night guard. He looks pretty cool. What is he? He's a bow and arrow, right, Beebs? Uh huh. And look. Wow. And go up here. Okay. Where the stairs? Mm -hmm. So, Bubs, you made this from scratch. This is your this is your flag. We all have flags in this game. Mm -hmm. If a zombie makes it to a flag, it's GG all of us. Right, Beebs? Mm -hmm. And Dad, do you see this? And look, I'm growing farms up here. Beebs, you got a three-level crop farm. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Oh, Bubs, look alive. We are at nighttime, so we have to help our night guards uh, boop some zombies. So guys, the game, this is basically like Minecraft, except it's like also a defense game where every night hordes of bad guy zombies come, right? Mm -hmm. And we have to protect it. So that's Bubs' base. And this is my base right here. This is my flag right here. Guys, we've fallen in love with this game. We're like obsessed with it. We play it like every chance we get. Oh, Beebs, look alive. Zombies. Uh -huh. Oh, oh. So we just got an upgrade for our guards that are now, like, oh. they went from slingshots to bow and arrows. A zombie inside my house almost killed someone in my bed. Oh, yikes, but we gotta we gotta get you one more guard. Because I see a spot right here, but you don't have a guard on post. It has a square, but he's not here. Open up your menu and see if you can hire one more guy. Do this. Hire. Oh, I see him, I see him. Hello, so, oh. Hey, why are you sleeping, buddy? You're, uh, you're on the job, man. You're going to be so... Oh, he's awake. Oh, there he is. Good morning, sir. You need to get to your post quick. We got whores of zombies that are trying to boop us in the face. Oh, there's another one. There's a few more. We, I like to help the guards, although we just got the upgrade, and, man, they're crushing it. So we are... Ooh, oh, no. What did they just do? So we just... Um, got an upgrade for making bread because we constantly are having to manage our food. It's kind of like the money in this game. Whoa. So what we did was we did four rows of, or three rows of uh, wheat. And with the wheat, we make bread. Maybe, Beavis, if you get a chance, add a, a, add a one, two, three, add a fourth level onto your, your wheat tower. Okay, it looks like the sun's coming up, which means our guys should be waking up. Rise and shine, y'all. It's time to work. Oh, they're already working. So this is like my little workstation here where everyone's doing something. Someone's making tools. Someone's like in the mines uh, collecting tin and copper. Let's go visit them real quick. What's up, guys? Y'all happy down here? Yeah, we're doing good, man. Hi, dude. Hi. This dude is farming the done um wheat and putting down baby ones so they can grow let me see him coming at the very top very very top on my way nice stairs doo doo Thanks. nice oh yeah look at that he's harvesting the the, the mature ones and yeah. he's replanting oh i just fell again oh my gosh i'm gonna end up dying and losing all my stuff so bees press the i button real quick let's look at our science center and see what kind of cool upgrades we have was archery the last one that you did, the bows and arrows? Yeah. What about Taylor? Do you see a blue blob with a piece of scissors and a white thing? Yeah. Let's research it, Beebs. In the meantime, what do I need? I have a lot of food, 432 food, so that's, that's not bad. I'm gonna go make a quick round and go check my farms real quick. We have a couple berry farms. Although, the second we got wheat fields, I don't even know if the berry farms are even relevant anymore. Dudu, how many wheat, uh, how many berry farms do you have? Two. You have two? Okay. No, I think I have three. I think you have three as well. Let's just keep them there for the time being. Oh, wow. Boo -boo. That was huh. quick. I'm already done. I did my, my science research. Is yours done too? The Taylor research? Yeah. So this new block allows you, us to turn uh, flax seeds into linen. I'm not really sure what we, we can do with linen, but we're going to find out. Let's see. There's a tailor shop right there. Let's uh -huh. make a tailor shop real quick. And go ahead and place it and then let's hire another dude to man it okay okay so guys the gist of this game it's kind of like minecraft but automated like if you're doing it right you shouldn't have to do anything we have so many people like 18 people so far i've seen colonies on youtube where people have like 200 people and it's just so cool all right so now we have this new block and instead of us doing it manually we're actually going to hire someone right now to do it for us so i'm going to go up to the command tool or the banner tool and re recruit a colonist. Oh, it says uh, not enough free beds. Bees, do you have any beds? Um, yeah, my dudes are working making some beds. What? What? Dad. What? You know how much arrows I have? How many? Like a thousand. What? Yeah. 
That's that's bonkers. All right, I just dropped five beds, babes. Like, I'm not gonna have to worry about beds for a while. All right, banner tool, right click, recruit colonist. Let's see, he should spawn at this place. And if I got this right, he should come over. I'm gonna follow him to make sure that I didn't do something wrong. This, this game could be a little confusing. There you go, look at him. Going to work. All right, technologist unlocks the technologist who crafts science bags. I don't know what that means, but that sounds amazing. All right, we're gonna research it right now. In the meantime, while uh, we're good on food, like, because we're constantly adding more and more people, our demand for food is like, gets stronger and stronger. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna add another layer to our mega wheat factory here. I gotta, I gotta be quick because I like to just make sure that no zombies get in. I mean, I think our guards are strong enough, Beavis, but we should consider adding like a third guard. What do you think? Yeah. <gasps> what? Maybe making, putting a guard on top of, on our roof. Oh, Bobs, that's the best idea you've ever had. We're doing it right now. How do I get down from here? Where am I? All right, let's go. We're gonna make a guard tower right in the middle between our, our two bases. Yeah, and I, and I have enough bricks. Okay, let's do this thing right now, baby. Where should we go? Um, hmm. Ma let's make it close to our homes. Okay, I'm gonna put the, the groundwork for it. Uh, let's see. Boo, boo how about like right here beeps this is such a good idea we're gonna make a like a little guard zone let's yeah see, like a tower let's see if he's right here and a zombie comes to yours totally in the boop zone my oh beeps yep done this is it this is the spot this is my spot oh you're gonna make your own yeah even better boo, -boo. we're gonna have double action huh because do you remember so your own workers Make your own stuff. Yeah, that's right. Um, I kind of want to make it elevated just because I think that'd be super sweet. I don't think we've ever done an elevated guard. I wonder if they can shoot downward. Surely, right? Mm. Okay, I don't know what this is actually going to look like, but we're going to find out. I don't know if this is going to be a little bit weird or what, eh? Going around, going around, going around. I'm kind of just making this up as I go along. We definitely need that there so we can actually get in. So if he's right here. Oh yeah, he's got a great vantage point. Done. All right, babes, I'm so excited about our little guard pose. Ah, uh, and look. Here, well, let me see. Buzz, nice platform, bro. Uh huh? All right, I'm gonna go ahead and get the command tool, and I'm gonna hire a guard, a bow guard, and I'm gonna put him right here. Yes. All right, let's go ahead and recruit him. Hey, dude. Let's see how you like your post. Oh, he's at his post, beeps. Let's see if he can actually poop him out up there. He looks intimidating up there. I'm even gonna ask. Oh, he totally has amazing reach. Oh my gosh, GG zombies. All right, where's my torches? I wanna add to this. Torches, now we used to, at the very beginning of this game, we've actually been playing this level for a while. At the very beginning, we had to craft all this stuff ourselves, but now we have a dude who crafts our torches. He crafts basically everything. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and climb up here. I'm gonna put torches up on every corner. Let's go check out what dude is doing. Beeps, is this your guard? Uh-huh. I love it. I put down two. Hey, good morning, guys. Night's over. I feel pretty safe now. I feel like we could even walk away from our computer at this point, just because, uh -huh. like, I don't know. I think they're good. All right, I'm gonna get grass. I'm gonna finish. Beeps, what I would recommend you do, just so we stay ahead of our uh, food need, uh -huh. is I would go add a, a third or fourth level for your wheat tower, okay? All right, here we go, done. Now I'm gonna get to the top of it and I'm gonna add another crate. What these crates do is usually if they're done harvesting, they have to walk it all the way back to your flag, which is quite a long walk. It's down there. It takes them forever. So instead what we do is we give them a place to drop it off at. All right, I'm gonna create a job. Bees, do you need some help over there? Um, no. Cool. All right, I'm gonna create wheat farm 10 by 10 and we're gonna hire another dude. Perfect. And that leaves 21 colonists. That's really good. Let's look at our science tab too while you get a chance, babes. It looks like we're done with the technologist. Uh, I don't know if that gave us a new uh, thing to build. Technology table. Babes, do you see it? Huh. You should have one in your inventory whenever you get a chance. It looks like two uh, knives. Do you see it? I see two swords. That's it. Me too, I got one too. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna drop that in our, in my base and hire someone to man it. Boo Boo, how much do you love this game? It's pretty great, right? Yeah. All right guys, we're gonna, we're gonna keep playing. Thanks so much for watching. Bye-bye.